I saw they also had Sidewinder. Ah, oh, dang. I love this. What are you guys shooting at? Hell yeah. Welcome back. I am a friendly pest and today I'm playing Contractors. This is a first person shooter in VR. Uh, I'm playing on an Oculus Quest 2, streaming the game from my PC over Airlink. So this is the PC version. Um, and the biggest reason I'm on this today is I learned that there are some pretty cool Halo mods and I wanted to check them out. And we're gonna check those out together, see what this is like. I spent just a few minutes figuring out how to download them, but that's pretty easy. I'll show you guys real quick. You go to mods. Here's all the featured mods, all the regular mods. You find what you want, you download it. Like here's Damnation, that was a Halo 1 map. If I want this, I just hit subscribe. Bang, it drops up here and downloads. And then when I create a server, I, uh, I can use this map. I also downloaded a Halo loadout, so that includes the Halo weapons. And I've got all kinds of cool stuff, like a melee only. There's all kinds of Call of Duty maps. Here's a Nuketown one. Here's something called Fight Club. Like th there's tons of mods for this. So that's pretty cool. But I'm going to create a game. I'm going to put a password on it. Uh, yeah. Unhackable. So create password North America uh, mod cross-platform. So it looks like the mods can be played with PC or the native version on the Quest. I have played the native Quest version and had a good experience with that. So first we'll change the map. We'll go to mods. We're going to try Battle Creek. Uh, we'll go over to our loadouts, go to mods, we're going to add in our Halo mods. Uh, free for all gun game, no, 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 no. Uh, team deathmatch, team deathmatch. We'll add some bots because I've got a password, I don't want players jumping in and screaming obscenities while I'm trying to record this. Uh, let's see how this goes. Pretty much the only thing I've figured out so far is how to actually download the mods and, and create the server. So as far as actually using them in the game and those experiences, that's all going to be fresh. We'll see how this goes. I love the mod support for these shooters. Slayer. So they've got the voice and everything in here. Loadout. Uh, battle rifle, SMG, AR, sniper rifle. Let's try the battle, or the regular AR. That might be fun. Uh, pistol, energy sword, grenades. That'll work. Back. Uh, deploy. Slayer. Slayer. That's, you can two-hand it. The ammo counter works. It's got a charging handle on it. There's ammo supplies around. Like, this is... Look, they've even tweaked the gravity on the jump. See the floaty jump? It's like, ow! What a bastard. Let's try that again. Like, this is... This is such a well done mod that I'm surprised that they're getting away with it. Which I don't know how all that works, so. Well, this gun. How do you take the. I dropped a grenade! Okay, okay, okay. Well, there's how the mag comes out. Goes in. Charging handle there. We're back in game. Sorry, friend. So the AR is way more effective in, in VR than the Halo. I don't quite understand the charging handle on it. Oh, it locks back. Okay, I see. And these are just bots, right? So they're not gonna they're not gonna be super smart. This is awesome. Let's try the pistol. Damn, that was a good shot. What did he hit me with? That's not a Halo gun. I'll try this uh, pistol again. We'll consider another. What's that? That's a magazine. Let's go.
Come on, come on. <sighs> Dry. Let me shank his ass. He's carrying something else. I don't know where he got that. Not fast enough. Not fast enough. Yeah, okay. Let's try a different. Let's try a different. Uh, let's try the SMG. That was always fun. Oh, there's Covenant weapons too. All right, first we're gonna try the SMG though. This is awesome. Like I, I could see getting some friends together and having a riot on this. Running riot. See, it's like that. I should probably figure out how to reload this before I go shooting it. Get down. How do you eject the magazine on this bastard? Oh, it's on the side. And there's the charging handle. So you never learn that stuff when you play Halo because you just hit X to reload. This thing feels pretty, pretty, I don't know. It's, I like it, but it's not great. Get down. This is going to be a mistake. I love that. Ah! Get down. Should have pulled the sword. Should have pulled the sword. Maybe some of the damage could reuse. Could use some rebalancing. Oh look, I'm even the master chief when I the character model. That's awesome. Let's check out some covenant weapons. Let's see what they've done with the needler. Right, it pretty much stands no chance in being use worth or worth using. Right, something like that. Words. Let's see. Well, it's all it's all darked out, which is interesting. Works good. How do you reload it? Oh, you just hit B and it reloads. There you go, bruv. So, the needler is actually super good. That's fun. Let's try the carbine. I wonder, like the carbine actually, there was actually like a... Uh, a thing they put in the side of it when they reloaded, so it'll probably need to be reloaded. We'll figure it out. Somebody up there? I saw they also had Sidewinder. Ah, dang. I love this. Who are you guys shooting at? Hell yeah. This thing's nasty. Out of ammo. If I could get quick to pull that sword, that could be awesome, but I, I don't think I'll ever be quick enough to do that. Let's find out. The pistol's kind of terrible. I need a magazine. Oh no, I need a magazine. No, I ejected it. This is less the game's fault. Uh, and more my fault. Like, I'm, I'm really struggling with the basic controls. That's on me, because I haven't played this much. Uh, let's try the BR out, and then we'll have kind of seen the loadouts, and we'll have seen this map. So, then maybe we'll take a look at another map and move on. How's that sound? This would be so fun with, like, people I grew up with playing Halo. But you know what? They're not cool enough to play VR. They, they're not as crazy about it as I am. They'll get there eventually. You guys are in the way. It would be cool if you could download bot skins also, so they looked like Spartans. The bots really like the, the rooftops. Notice you can't see through the scope. I think you can with the sniper rifle. 
How do you reload this thing? Drop it, boy. Damn, some of these guys take crazy damage. I could see that being rebalanced a little bit. Let's go ahead and leave this match. This is pretty cool, though. I could see that being rebalanced a little bit. Uh, or maybe the, the headshot multiplier is really strong, and I'm just not landing the headshots like I think I am. Um, multiplayer. Casual create game. Password. Um, mod cross platform, yes. Let's see. What else have we got? What else have we got? Uh, mods. Uh, damnation. I'm not really interested in seeing Damnation, to be honest. I kind of want to check out Nuketown, though. Uh, so what do we have? It's like, I've only downloaded one loadout. So let's see what kind of official stuff I got. Ninja Warrior. Pistols only, which would probably be a riot. Let's do pistols only. What's Bounty Hunter? So there's some pretty cool... Let's do a gun game round. Let's do a gun game round. It won't be pistols only, probably, because it'll be gun game, right? So Nuketown, uh, gun game, five bots. Let's go. This is great. Like, one of my favorite genres in, in VR is actually, like, board games and stuff, but you can't deny how good shooters are in it. It's so fun. And it's... I think it's... It's less frustrating... Oh, what's this? Nuke down. What kind of loadouts? None because because we're on gun game. I'm ready when you are. Let's go. So we're starting with something good. Instantly switched. That's pretty slick. Oh, it's all like pixelated too. This isn't like regular Nuke Town. It's like Minecraft Nuke Town. What's up with that? This is awesome. You gotta love the mod community. He must have been super wounded because he went down easy. Whoa. I know she can't really run with your weapon up, kind of automatically slow down. Come on, bro. That was the first shot. Got me. It got me good. Well, they even kind of got collisions and stuff. This is not going to work. Damn, I'm getting my ass kicked. How do I change the fire mode on this thing? Let's try that. There we go. Oh no. Oh no, it's bolt action. Whew, well I'm glad he was a terrible bot. Okay, it wasn't clean. It wasn't clean, but we got there. This is awesome. Let's take a look at some of the other mods just for fun. Okay. Major error on my part. I, uh, I thought I had password protected the room because I'm just trying to show off bots and stuff, and then players started joining and talking, and I tried to leave the lobby, and I accidentally crashed the game. So 
uh, stellar performance on my part as usual. Just to wrap this up, let's look at some of the other mods that are available for fun's sake. Uh, I guess sticking with the trending category for the moment. Hang on, I gotta work through a desync issue here. There we go. Uh, oh wow, it moved twice on me. I don't want it to do that. Airport, Ancient Eagle, Arena, that's kinda cool. The loadouts are interesting to me, right? Sorry, I'm having some. I'm having a few desync issues here. Let's take a look at the recently updated loadouts. See what there is. Hardcore, standard, test. No collision, melee only. So there's not a ton of loadouts yet, but there there are loadouts. Uh, and then when we go to maps, let's go to what happened. Uh, popular. I'll figure this out. I promise I'll figure this out. Turn off loadouts first. How's that? There we go. Okay. Yeah. So these are popular maps. I mean, there's a lot to this. I love that about, about VR games. The mod community is constantly creating new content that you can check out. So if you like the foundation of a game, the mod community is going to rise up and give you more content. Oh, look at that. They need like a, a Western weapon loadout. That would be really cool. There's Rust. This is awesome. Oh, here we go. Snowbound from Halo 3. Elongation, cold storage, the pit, uh, midship. So there's all these, oh, there's Prisoner. That's the very first Halo game I ever played was right. Uh, no Prisoner on Combat Evolved at a friend's house. Didn't even have a, a gamer tag yet. Uh, Narrows. So this is awesome. There's so much high ground, turf, Valhalla, uh, Epitaph. So pretty much any Halo map you want is here. There's even Sand Trap. Coagulation. And it looks like all the Call of Duty maps are here. And then they've got some cool loadouts too. Like this is great. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Oh, the speed soft small. That's this is this is very cool. This is very cool. This is a game I, I, I wished I uh, that I played more. Uh, I love the I love the support it gets. And it feels pretty good. There's a few differences to it that I haven't gotten used to. Like uh, B ejects. And then right now I've got it set to where my trigger grabs, grabs the mag instead of my grip button. And I haven't gotten used to that. But it's kind of nice because if you want a two hand, that's the grip button. So there's no, there's no button confusion there. See what I mean? And then it, it actually works pretty well. Uh, and then changing the fire mode and stuff, I haven't got used to that. But yeah, this has been Contractors. Uh, checking out some of the mods, which I really enjoyed. I need, I need to get me a group of friends that like to play uh, shooters like this so we can explore these mods together and have fun with that. That would be a lot of fun. Uh, anyhow, hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick look at some of the mods the Contractors has now, which I'm super impressed with. I know there's Pavlov also has a huge mod community. Uh, I didn't start on Pavlov. I played this one first, and I kind of like the feel of it better. Um, but I also have Pavlov, and I, I understand that there's also tremendous mod support there I need to look at, too. But, yeah. Anyway, I'm not sure what day I'll, up I'll upload this. But uh, hopefully whenever you find this video, it finds you in good health and happiness. Hopefully you're having a good week. Hopefully you got some fun weekend plans. Hopefully you're spending your free time with the people you want to spend your free time with. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.